In the mind-bending Netflix series Dark, characters are trapped inside an infinite time travel loop, endlessly repeating events in an attempt to understand their past or change their fate. It's like hitting the rewind button on your life, only to find out you're not just going back, but you're also setting the stage for everything that's already happened. Dark is that kind of show that really messes with your head. And no matter how many times you watch it, there is always something new that leaves you puzzled. But what if I told you that there is a concept in math that works in a pretty similar way? You might remember covering recursive functions in your math or programming classes. A recursive function is a function that calls itself to solve a problem. A classic example is calculating a factorial. Like to find 5 factorial, you will multiply 5 by 4 factorial. In order to find out 4 factorial, we need to multiply 4 with 3 factorial. And in order to find 3 factorial, we need to multiply 3 with 2 factorial until we reach 1 factorial which we know is just 1. Think of each trip back in time as a call to a recursive function. Every time a character travels back, they are essentially calling the function again, hoping for a different outcome. But just like in a recursive factorial function, how each step is dependent on the previous step, the characters are caught in an infinite loop with their actions both influenced by and influenced from past and future events. This makes me wonder what if our own lives are similarly recursive in nature. I mean, consider this. Every decision that we make is based on the outcomes of the previous choices and those previous choices were based on the choices before them. But here's the kicker. In math, the recursive functions have a base case, a condition that stops the recursion. Are we like the characters in Dark simply executing our recursive functions, constantly returning to our past decisions in our attempts to change the future? And if so, what is our base case? What is the condition that would break our cycle? Is that what is called enlightenment? Are we fated to follow these infinite loops? Or is there a chance for us to find a moment, a decision, a chance that changes everything? In Dark, finding that base case is the key to breaking the infinite time loop. It's like looking for that elusive one factorial in a never-ending chain of factorials. This brings me to ponder the very fabric of reality. Are we some players in some predestined loop or the architects of our own fate? The next time you're faced with a decision, ask yourself, are you merely repeating the past or are you creating a new future?